Okay guys, RK994 here, and a couple of you guys were asking me to do a review on these and how, how they felt and all, and how the quality was, and uh, I guess I should do that now. Don't want to keep you guys waiting. But before I go, I forgot, I didn't see this at first when I was doing the unboxing, but Turtle Beach also gave me a complimentary flashlight keychain, so, and it's like really cool, the flashlight isn't suckish at all, look at that. That's a pretty good flashlight for a keychain. Like, really. And it says, play like a pro, which I am. Alright, I'm joking. But, uh, yeah, that's a pretty cool keychain. But, let's get into this review. I'm going to make it as in-depth as, as I can. So, I've got a, I got a good two days to try these out. Uh, first thing I noticed, uh, they're kind of, at first, they're kind of uncomfortable on the ears. I mean... It, if the cups were bigger, they would be perfect. But the cups are kind of small, and they kind of hurt the ears. But once you get the get them adjusted right, uh, it shouldn't feel too bad on your ears. It should feel fine. Uh, the padding up here does a really well job. Uh, it keeps the head feeling good. It doesn't hurt or anything. Uh, adjustments really helpful. Doesn't fall off your head. Aren't isn't very loose. The cups are really cool because they can fold in. Like when you're trying to hear something besides the game, or your iPod, which this works for very well, if you're in your own room or not out in public, because sound will play through these. Because they, they expect you to be playing these in your home on your game, so there's no need to keep them quiet. So I can understand that. But they do fold up. Let's see if I can do this. Hold on one second. All right, they kind of fold up like that. I did a kind of bad job because the cords are very long, which is another thing I don't like about it. The cords need to be long for it to hook up to the TV, which is a big mess right now. Well, I won't even explain that, but uh, the cords very long because I, I like to use it for my iPod because the quality of sound it delivers is very good. So, but it's just a very long cord, so I wish it was a little bit easier to manage. But hey, it's not really built for the iPod, so I can't argue. Uh, like I was saying, it folds up really cool. The mic is adjustable, so if you listen to your iPod, you can put it on your head. I keep talking about my iPod for some reason. Let's get back to the actual 360. Uh, you need to have it connected either to the mic port on your TV or have the splitter both red and white connected to the splitter because red is the left cup and white is the right cup and I, at first I don't usually have my red cup because my TV is outdated and I use a VCR prehistoric but uh, yeah I usually don't use the red so I had to uh, hook myself up in order to hear stuff out of the left right left ear okay also it tells you to play through your set the settings so the voices play through your head your headset and your TV but the thing about that is if you're in a party and say you're in Halo 3 matchmaking and the people who aren't in your party have mics in the lobby you can still hear them in your party so it kind of defeat I mean, they can't hear you, but you can still hear them, so it's kind of annoying. Uh, I think you can just solve that problem by turning it to mic only. It doesn't alter the sound or anything. Uh, all the sound does come through the headsets. Very, very, very good quality sound uh, as far as game-wise goes. Uh, as far as party, as the party chat, um... It can sometimes be drowned out by the game audio if it's too loud. Uh, it was happening today. I couldn't hear a word one of my friends were saying because of the halo. There were so many grenades going off. But uh, yeah, the party chat is very it's very clear, but sometimes it's not loud enough. So yeah, that's what's up. Uh, got the whatever millimeter mic thingy 
you can plug in computer, iPod, or the mic thingy, the mic splitter they gave you, the headset splitter. You got this small thing, fits perfectly into your mic port to your controller. Uh, overall, I would say this is a very, very good um, piece of hardware. As for headsets, it's only $10 more than Microsoft headset, and this is way better than a Microsoft headset, hands down. So, if you can, I'd suggest you pick this up. It's, it's well worth the money for the price. So, yeah, RK994 out. Decide what you decide. Pick it up. I suggest it.